Hi fashionistas, I'm Chi Chi if you're new. In today's video, drum roll, I'm excited, is going to be my Nordstrom anniversary sale haul. So get comfortable, get a drink, and let's get into it. If you're returning, shout yourself out in the comments and let the new kids know how we treat family around here. Y'all, one thing we do around here is slay while saving some coins and Nordstrom with this anniversary sale got us all of the stylish goodness. We've got statement pieces, versatile basics that will have you slaying and let's not forget some bling bling that will make your outfits pop. Now the question is, where do I start? You know what, let's start with a pop of color. I picked up this pink bomber jacket. As you can see, I instantly fell in love with it. Bomber jackets are definitely having a moment. Now, I will be honest in saying that this jacket is actually not in the anniversary sale, but I believe everything else I share after this point is, but the color was too good to pass up. I'm definitely seeing this as a potential concert outfit. You could pair with a crop top, some um, cut off shorts and combat boots, okay, to add a little edginess. You could do a little slinky dress underneath it, some boots as well you can definitely throw on some jeans some heels with this look like it has so much potential if you are around my complexion this color looks so good on it does have a little bit of padding which means it's perfect for the transitional weather that I am hoping will come soon it's made out of this really soft comfortable satin and it's not so heavy that it would be something that you would wear like in the winter it's really the perfect blend as we go into the fall and winter and if you're like me and you love to wear color year round in my opinion this is definitely a must-have but let me know in the comments what you think about this pink bomber are you for it are you against it and I got this in a size large or extra large I'm not sure but I'll have the details in the description box down below for you and I will say this it definitely runs big okay I am NOT a size extra large large whatever the size of this bomber is I can't I have so much ample room in this so I would say if you're smaller than me like maybe if you're like a mid true mid size like a 14 16 you definitely size down unless you really want that oversized fit I just realized that I got ahead of myself and I did not talk about my outfit of the day how dare I <laughs> <laughs> so for outfit of the day, this top that I have on is actually a cute little crop top like so like that. This is from Shopo. I get questions about Shopo all of the time. Honestly, a lot of my like latest sort of like statement finds have come from them. They're an Australian brand. It's annoying to shop from them because it comes all the way from Australia, takes a couple of days, and they only go up to a size 16 quote unquote. I'm not a size 16 and I comfortably fit there. What I like about them is that they're really great for the summer months because they always have these super unique pieces like pieces that I would find in places like My Teresa, Netta Porter, like those really fun trendy yet elevated cuts. I don't know how to explain it you know. They usually don't come in larger sizes. I can always check them out. I always stick to their oversized pieces just so I'm sure that things fit will fit. I, I stay away from the fitted stuff but like a top like this that has voluminous sleeves definitely fit perfectly I had this maxi dress white maxi dress with the cutouts fit perfectly this pink dress so you can kind of like get the gist of what they're working with I just have it paired with these wide leg pants that I picked up from Eloquy honestly these are some of the best fitting wide leg pants I've ever seen for girls with tummies my only qualm with this thing is that it's not tall girl friendly like I wish it was long enough for me to throw on like a four inch heel with it but it's not so I tend to dress it down when I wear it with just like some simple slides and whatnot and this is an easy look that I would definitely wear to like a brunch I just have my oral necklace last time I checked it was sold out but if it's back in stock I will link it for you down below and this is from Marine Costello they make waterproof jewelry so that's my outfit of the day I used to be the girl that only wore color in the spring and summer. Not anymore. 
I love color year round. And as soon as I saw this sweater, I could see its potential as we transition into fall and of course into winter. What I love about this sweater is that it's a lightweight knit. So you can definitely pull it out as soon as sweater weather hits. I love the fact that it's stretchy, light weight. And of course the colors, the blue, the pink, the orange means it's gonna be super versatile. And you can pair it with saturated shades like I've done here with this like burnt orange, but also all of your jewel tones come fall and winter. The stripe pattern means that I can dress it up if I like or dress it down. I just paired it with a satin skirt and some sneakers, but you could also swap out those sneakers and pair it with a pair of heels, a pair of jeans. Did I mention it's versatile? Let me know what you think about this one in the comments down below. Now, I know it's back to school season. So many of the girlies, teachers are going back into the classroom. And even if you're a corporate girly, we're in that transitional season where we're already thinking about fall. And this is a great time, in my opinion, to sort of like refresh your work wardrobe in time for the cooler weather. So I have several pieces that I think would be great for that. As someone who's like a creative consultant, I work for myself. I try to have like a Rolodex of pieces that I can can use to smarten up my look because it's not everyday crop tops. Sometimes we gotta be professional, okay? So the first item that caught my eye was this sleeveless vest. Again, this is perfect for the transitional season because you just throw this on over a button down shirt and you can either pair some trousers with it, leggings with it. If the shirt's more on the longer size, like a tunic style, you could throw on jeans with this, especially if you wanna do like casual Fridays, but you still wanna look pulled together. Maybe you have a meeting. This would work. What really made this a must have for me was the length of this. Usually I see these type of like vest type sleeveless situations in like shorter length. But the fact that this is longer is a A plus. Now when I was in the classroom, I taught high school. So I was always just cognizant of like what I wore in terms of making sure it wasn't too short, making sure things weren't too tight. You know, <laughs> we have teenage boys. I picked it up in a size 2X just for reference. And I would say if you're like me and you're a hippie and you just want that like extra room it might be a great idea to size up and maybe get it tailored around the bust now what i also love about sizing up is that you could technically wear it as a dress belt it up throw on a little statement belt totally see this with like over the knee boots and maybe like a knee length shirt dress and you have a whole look <laughs> with the work wear for my girls is going to be this leather A-line midi skirt. All the things that I love. A-line skirts are the best for my curvy girls, especially if you have a belly or a fupa or an apron belly. Tell me you always wanna go for an A-line style and notoriously leather skirts are not flattering because they tend to highlight that area. However, an A-line style that flows away from the body will work every single time. I also love that it has that little split, okay, for my teachers, which means you have some range of motion and it's not like overly shiny or just like overly cheap looking, stitching is on point. And the quality, the thickness of the leather, it's not too heavy, it's not too light. Really, they did their thing with this faux leather. And the skirt I picked up from the Not Your Daughter's Jeans brand and you know they know how to cut pieces for women. with the faux leather I also picked up these brown faux leather pants if you are a creative like me or you work in like a business casual environment I love leather pants for the transitional period but all the way throughout winter because they're a great alternative to a pair of jeans right you can dress them down with some sneakers you can dress them up with some boots or some pumps for those days where you don't want to wear a trouser they're a great option they're also edgy enough that if you have like some after hours plans they would come 
in clutch. I'm obsessed with the color of this. I sized up to a 20W just to accommodate the hips and the thighs and the belly. I love the fact that it has like this suede on the inside of the pant, which means, I don't know about y'all, but sometimes like faux leather, especially one that isn't lined, can just like, like start to chafe and just kind of like irritate your skin. Also that suede inside also really helps with the noise because we already know faux leather tends to make that squishy, switchy noise when you walk. <laughs> now I have a little hack for you guys. If you happen to have whole leather pieces that do make that swishy noise when you move, rub some baby oil. It'll make that noise like disappear. You will get rid of the noise that you get from the friction of your body rubbing together. And the pants have pockets on the sides, no pockets in the back. It's a zipper closure. I love the fact that it's more of like a trouser cut, which gives it a ton of versatility and makes it a piece that you can definitely wear from work to weekend. Speaking of weekends, make sure you stay tuned because I picked up a couple pieces that I think you would love. They're the perfect treat yourself or someone you love pieces and I just feel like not enough people are talking about it. Now, I also picked up some undergarments as well because I think this sale is a great time to save on things like quality bras, shapers, all those kind of things that never, they don't really go on sale like that. So make sure you stay tuned for that as well. If I had a dollar for the amount of times I get DMs and messages about what to wear as a wedding guest, y'all, I would have some bands in the bank. So as soon as I saw this print ruffle dress from Chelsea 28, I knew I had to share it with you guys, especially since it's under $60 and it's in the sale. The twirly hem, the ruffle sleeve skimming effect makes it perfect for day or night events. I am wearing it here in a size 2X and my recommendation for you is to size up. So how did I do? <laughs> weekend I love me some loungewear and so I'm always looking in the sale for some good loungewear and this year the first thing I picked up was this two-piece set now they're sold separately from Nike it's a oversized um sweatshirt with some matching shorts my idea for this was gonna be like a summer travel outfit because you know it's always freezing on the plane but it's hot outside so you know you could throw a tank on and these shorts on while you're outside and when you get inside the airport or get on the plane you throw on your sweatshirt however I'm on the fence on this one because I just feel like the shorts are a little bit on the shorter side but I just fell in love with the color of this it's kind of giving like a, a mustardy brown color and I just love the way yellow just like lightens and brightens up my complexion I'm wearing the top in a 2x and I feel like I could have sized down it does run quite oversized and it's a little cropped not fully cropped but it's a little cropped I don't know <laughs> you guys can see and then the shorts the shorts is really the part that's giving me a little pause because they're a little short okay like they're a little like if I turn around you can, you know it's giving really close to the cheek I don't know if I'm trying to be out there in the airport with as much cheek as these shorts are giving me but I also got these in the extra extra large again I'm a size 18 20 and all my measurements and details and all that stuff always is in the description box if you're wondering for reference that's where I'm kind of like mm, so I want you guys to let me know what you think about this set keep or return as far as the weight of the set I think it's perfect for travel it's thick enough so you're warm when you're traveling but it's not like so overbearing that you know like a heavy fleece that you'll be like super uncomfortable you know if you have to pop out for a few seconds so that is pretty much that also picked up another set that's more of a loungewear set. Nordstrom has a brand um, called Open Edit. I honestly feel like Nordstrom made brands. Um, not a lot of people or not enough people talk about it because the quality to me is typically there and the price point is typically a little bit less than comparable name brands on the Nordstrom website. So it's a three piece set. If you follow me on Instagram, you know I love me a lounge set. You know I love me some cute shorts, a cozy sweater, and a little crop top. And what I love 
love about these sets is how versatile they are because yes I can wear this while I'm working in the home like on an admin day or if I'm chilling just watching a movie or whatever at home maybe you know I got somebody popping by and I want to look cute like I love a set like this for that but also if I need to pop to the store I can just ditch the shorts and throw on a pair of jeans and it still looks like a pull together outfit I can be on my zoom in this and nobody will know that you know it's a set it's like a lounge set it just looks like a twin set from above so I love pieces like this and I have one too many okay of them and but I didn't have any in this blue color it's like baby bluish color but I am like trying to be into this year about not buying too much of the same thing so I would love your opinion on this one is it a keep or is it a return all right now another thing that I had to I will say I have too much of this but it's a repeat customer for me is going to be the moonlight pajamas this year they showed out in the plus size category they got these pajamas in every color in the past they would only have like the black color for us but this year this is a cult repeat favorite everyone everyone everybody who shops the sale knows about these pajamas and I feel like people know it's great I think I got my first pair like three or four years ago before it came in plus I got like the largest size and I still have it I still wear it I think I wore it like two or three days ago here are the reasons why these pajamas are so loved right are, are such bestsellers the quality of the jersey a lot of times when you get these like type of pajamas that are very soft and brushed after a couple of washes they start getting holes in them they just don't last the second is as you can see it has like a trimming and typically again when you get these pajamas at like you know more affordable price points as soon as you throw that thing in a wash the color bleeds onto the trim it looks a mess it's not nice anymore this these pajamas never do that so although that there are a lot of dupes and if I will probably link a dupe down below I feel like paying the extra maybe ten dollars for these during the sale time because when it's not on sale it's way more expensive <laughs> what would you cut the paying the extra ten dollars for these is definitely worth it for what you're getting and again that's why the girlies come back every year to purchase it and this year they had it in so many colors I decided to stick to this brown color but they also have it in lavender so many colors so I will definitely link it for you down below now I actually didn't just pick up clothing I also picked up some beauty stuff as well we'll be glamming it up too I'll be sharing some beauty treasures some finds so that we can all be glowing and slaying like the queens we are so stay tuned for that Now let's get into the self-care, you know, lady of leisure, luxury finds, okay? These washable silk pajamas and the washable silk robe. So this comes in both black and white and I did pick up both colors. If you are a loungewear girl, if you love to be like, to luxuriate, if you like nice things, nice sheets, if that's your thing, then I highly recommend you grab these specifically because you typically can't find pieces like this in larger sizes, okay? I, I don't know why. So when I saw that these went up to a 3X, I grabbed it. I originally actually bought it in 2X. Definitely run small highly recommend you size up in these to the larger size now what i love about this pajama set is that technically it is pajamas but i have definitely worn already the silk trousers in black like a pair of trousers i think this is something that i would definitely pack with me on vacation or to a resort or even like to brunch like you could definitely dress this up with a cute top okay because it, it is silk and when i tell you that this thing feels like butter on the skin it feels like butter okay we deserve to feel great in the clothing that we're wearing we deserve okay to have a little bit of everyday luxury thrown in there into our wardrobe and so this is a must-have the robe comes true to size so you don't have to worry about that I think I got it in a 2x it fits comfortably I believe I got in a 2x see the description box it fits comfortably it's easy there's enough robe to go around and I highly recommend you grab these if this is your thing or if you're looking to treat maybe like your mom your best girlfriend or someone like that to something nice because we all we deserve nice things I definitely recommend and I will link it for you down below <laughs> So 
while we were on the subject, I also picked up this bra right here in the sale. And this is the Charlie bra by Alomi. I worked with this brand a couple of years ago. This to me is one of the better bra brands for my girls that have larger cup sizes. G, H, I, J, those sizes. They go up to a 44, I believe in the sale and up to like a double H, G, I, J. Again, if you are, I get questions about undergarments and bras and all that good stuff. And I know that quality bras in larger cup sizes, always so hard to find. So I definitely decided to include this in this haul. This is super comfortable. What I love about this brand is that they're so intentional about how they shape their bras, how thick the straps are on the bras, you know, the ease of wear. Like when you put this thing on, it is designed to hold the girls in place. And what I love about this bra is that it's definitely an everyday type of bra that you can just put on and forget about it. you guys we would talk about beauty I picked up three pieces I re-upped on my super goop play sunscreen this is also a cult favorite it's cast free it's ultra moisturizing yet non greasy and it's clean which is why all the girls love it and what I love about this is that you can use it on your face and you can use it on your body hence the giant pump size of body I also finally tried the Osea set they had a discovery set that included the body oil and the body butter and a travel size it's like a marine based like algae oil that is non-greasy but it looks infused with antioxidants you can like tell the difference like when I first pumped this out I thought it was gonna get everywhere it was gonna be you know just like greasy and yucky because of how thick the oil is but once you rub it in it literally melts into the skin like butter gives you this like subtle glow so I can definitely see what all the hype has been with this set I also picked up two pairs of shoes I almost forgot about them these new balances right here I actually had a pair of new balances in mind the 327s but they sold out in the women's section so I mosey on over to the men's section to see if they had them in stock they didn't but then I ran across these now I wear a size 11 for for sneakers I like to size up so I just got a size nine and a half in the men's and they fit perfectly love all the colors and the tones the brown the green the blue so i feel like it's going to be super versatile let me know what you think about these and then of course i had to pick up these shoes that i think are going to be such a huge statement okay with whatever you pair them with and this is like the perfect shoe for my girls who love all black this is how you do all black but you add a little pizzazz okay these like cowboy style boots as you can see it's all black in the front and then it has the white in the back and it has all of the fun little detailing and like motifs going through the shoe but the best part ever y'all is not only does it like stretchy you know there's a little elastication y'all it zips up so you don't even have to struggle because I honestly feel like sadists are the ones that came up with pull-on style shoes especially if you're a curvy girl you know the struggle all you gotta do is slide your foot into this girl and this went up to a size 12 so of course I had to grab that it comes in a couple of other colors as well if this is too much of a contrast for you it has comes like a two-tone brown and a couple other colors like that that may work better for your wardrobe but I had to share it with you so let me know y'all which one of these looks were your favorite is there anything that I put you on to that you may have missed since you've been shopping this sale? Let me know in the comments below if you're gonna be getting anything. Everything that we talked about in this video will be linked in the description box down below. Y'all know it's not just about shopping, it's about me sharing clothing with you that will help you feel confident and that you will be comfortable in your skin in. Until next time, keep shining, keep slaying, and keep loving yourself. Don't forget to rate, comment, subscribe, and share. Stay blessed.